intercession. How can you say it to each one? Jesus is risen. Hallelujah. Si Cristo ay nabuhay. Hallelujah. So our procession for today, we have Mary and the resurrected body of Jesus. All men would be going with the resurrected body of Jesus and there will be somebody who will lead us with a prayer. All women will be going to Mama Mary. So, and then when we arrive there, Mama Mary will be staying outside because they will still be having the play. So we will follow with our prayer leaders, okay? In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. The Lord be with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, 
full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Lord Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fire of hell, lead all Happy Easter, everyone. Happy Easter. We'd like to remind everyone to please silence your cell phones or your communications devices. You can keep them on, but please silence them so that uh, uh, we will not intrude upon the Salubung presentation this morning. And uh, we will begin our Salubung presentation with an, a narration of the purpose of Salubong, and we will begin that very, very shortly. So uh, once again, Happy Easter, everyone. Happy Easter. Welcome to Salubong. The Filipino tradition of portraying the presumed first meeting of the risen Jesus Christ with his mother, the Blessed Virgin Mary, during the day of his resurrection. In the Filipino tradition, Salubong takes place at dawn on Easter Sunday. This Filipino tradition is similar to the Spanish language tradition of El Encuentro de Jesus y la Virgen Maria, which is celebrated in many Latin American countries. Salubong is practiced in most Catholic communities across the Philippines. As per tradition, it begins with the recreation of the resurrection scene, 
then progresses with two separate processions. For the images of the Mater Dolorosa and the resurrected Christ are carried from opposite ends of town. The women accompany the statue of the Blessed Mother covered in a black veil of mourning. The men accompany the statue of the resurrected Christ. Eventually, the two processions will meet at a middle point, usually in or near the church, during which an angel will lift the black veil from the face of the image of the Blessed Mother. The angel is played by a young girl from the community and is typically positioned above the Mother Dolorosa statue. At the precise moment that the veil is lifted, the Alleluia chorus is played and the celebration continues to the Easter morning Mass. This beautiful tradition is now brought to you here at St. Genevieve through the efforts of the Simbangabi group. Happy Easter, and we hope we enjoy today's presentation of Salobo. After Jesus was buried, the chief priests and the Pharisees gathered before Pilate and asked to secure the tomb of Jesus by sealing the stone and setting guard. Some soldiers of the guard now approach the tomb. Are you guarding or are you sleeping? Guarding, sir. What is your report? Nothing going on, sir. Everything is clear, sir. And behold, there was a great earthquake, for an angel of the Lord descended from heaven. The angel came and rolled back the stone and sat upon it. His appearance was like lightning, and his raiment white as snow. And for fear of him, the guards trembled and became like dead men.
Yes, sir. Did you see what I said? Yes, sir. The Nazarene. He is written. Come on, let's get to the heartbeat. Now, after the Sabbath, toward the dawn of the first day of the week, Mary Magdalene and the other Marys prepare to see the tomb. I hope the soldiers are not there so we can pay respect to our master. If the soldiers are there, I hope they will allow us to pray and clean the tomb. I brought some fresh linen and perfume. I so much. Yes, me too. As they approached the tomb, an angel of the Lord appeared to them and said, Do not be afraid, for I know that you seek Jesus who was crucified. He is not here, for he has risen, as he says. Come, come, come. See the place where he lay. Our master's not here! Gone! There's no one! Not here, Christ! He's not there! Then go quickly and tell his disciples that he has risen from the dead, and behold, he is going before you to Galilee. There you will see him. Lo, I have told you. What? I don't believe. I don't want to see it by myself. The Master is gone. Go, go check. The Lord is not there. He's alive. He's risen. Let's go down and let me start to tell to the people of Galilee. So they departed quickly from the tomb with fear and great joy and ran to tell his disciples. While the Marys were going, behold, the guard went into the city to tell the chief priest all that had taken place. Risen from the dead. See this with your own eyes? I saw it in my own eyes. You're right. An angel appeared and rolled the stone over. An ill miracle. We tell this to everyone. What we're going to do is you tell the people, news. And somebody, his disciples, came in the middle of the night, he stole his body away, he hid it somewhere. Do you understand? Yes, I have faith. You take somebody, they should keep you quiet. Follow me.
And behold, Jesus met them and said, Hail! And they came up and took hold of his feet and worshipped him. Then Jesus said to them, Hail, come, do not be afraid. Do not be afraid, go and tell my brethren to go to Galilee, and there they shall see me.
let us pray. O God, who has been pleased to gladden the world with the resurrection of your Son, Lord Jesus Christ, grant, we pray, that through his mother, the Blessed Virgin Mary, we may receive the joys of everlasting life through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God, forever and ever. Amen. Gloria in excelsis Deo.
a reading from the Acts of the Apostles. Peter proceeded to speak and said, You know what has happened all over Judea, beginning in Galilee after the baptism that John preached, how God anointed Jesus of Nazareth with the Holy Spirit and power. He went about doing good and healing all those oppressed by the devil, for God was with him. We are witnesses of all that he did, both in the country of the Jews and in Jerusalem. They put him to death by hanging him on a tree. This man God raised on the third day and granted that he be visible not to all the people, but to us, the witnesses chosen by God in advance, who ate and drank with him after he rose from the dead. He commissioned us to preach to the people and testify that he is the one appointed by God as judge of the living and the dead. To him, all the prophets bear witness that everyone who believes in him will receive forgiveness of sins through his name. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. This is the day the Lord has made. Let us rejoice. Let us rejoice. This is the day the Lord has made, let us rejoice and be glad. This is the day the Lord has made, let us rejoice, let us rejoice. This is the day the Lord has made. St. Paul to the Colossians. 
brothers and sisters. If then you were raised with Christ, seek what is above, for Christ is seated at the right hand of God. Think of what is above, not of what is on earth. For you have died, and your life is hidden with Christ in God. When Christ your life appears, then you too will appear with him in glory. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. God. Please stand for the sequence. Christians to the Paschal victim, offer your thankful praises. Christians to the Paschal victim, offer your thankful praises. A lamb the sheep redeems, Christ who only is sinless. Reconcile sinners to the Father. Death and life have contended in that combat stupendous. The Prince of God who died reigns immortal. This just to the Paschal victim offer your thankful praise. Wayfaring, the tomb of Christ who is living, the glory of Jesus' resurrection. Bright angels attesting, the shroud and napkin resting. Yes, Christ, my hope is arisen to Galilee. He calls before you. Christians to the Paschal victim, offer your thankful praises. Christ indeed from death is risen, our new life obtaining. Have mercy, Victor King. Ever reigning. Christians to the Paschal victim, offer your thankful praises. Amen. Alleluia. From the Holy Gospel according to John. Glory 
early in the morning on the first day of the week. While it was still dark, Mary Magdalene came to the tomb. She saw that the stone had been moved away. So he ran off to Simon Peter and the other disciple, the one Jesus loved, and told them, The Lord has been taken from the tomb. We don't know where they have put him. At that, Peter and the other disciples started out on their way toward the tomb. They were running side by side, but then the other disciple outran Peter and reached the tomb first. He did not enter but bent down to peer in and saw the wrappings lying on the ground. Presently, Simon Peter came alone behind him and entered the tomb. He observed the wrappings in the ground and saw the piece of cloth which had covered the head, not lying with the wrappings, but rolled up in a place by itself. Then the disciple who had arrived first at the tomb went in. He saw and believed. Remember, as yet they did not understand the scripture that Jesus had to rise from the dead. The Gospel of the Lord. offer each other by saying to one another, Happy Easter! Happy Easter! Happy Easter!
Good morning again, everyone. Good morning. And uh, on behalf of St. Genevieve and the Simbangribi group of St. Genevieve, we would like to thank you for celebrating with us. And we would like to thank everyone who participated in today's presentation of Salubung. So if I call your name, please stand so we can recognize you. Please come in front in the sanctuary. Father says, please come in front, okay? Yes, the little angels who accompanied the Virgin Mary and the recent Christ float and their parents. Angels, come. The little angels who unveiled the Virgin Mary at the moment of Salobo, Risi Kanko. <laughs> Presenting the cast members of the Salobo play, Jesus Christ, played by Elfren Baklagan. The Angel of the Lord, Carlos Javier. Where's your wings, Kaloy? <laughs> Apostles Peter and John, Dom Olandai and Renee Laxon. <laughs> Angel Coates, Agnes Gulingay. The Three Marys, Jolie Andaya, Edna Sales, and Marina Marana. Please come forward. The Soldiers, Anselmo Marana, Ray Saldua, Nick Andaya, John Rabaha, Joseph Roses and Arnel Remo. The High Priest, Herman Gulingay. Carosa Pilots, Johnny Borromeo, Dam Kindera, and Jojo De Leon. And of course, the writer, voiceover, and director for the Salubong play, Mr. Noel Omega. <laughs> and our loving Salubong coordinators, Rick and Malu Yabut. Organizers of Salubo, the Simbangabi Group, led by Ernie Leoncio and Joe Vico. <laughs> Procession, Ernie Leoncio, Marina Borromeo. The crew, Johnny Leoncio and Alan Alvarez, <laughs> Jerry Kiabut, Ansel Maranan, Jess Escalanda, <laughs> Johnny Leoncio, Lakai, and Feli Saldoa. And we would like also to thank those who serve in today's sunrise liturgical celebration. Altar servers, <laughs> Eucharistic ministers, ushers, and the beautiful choir members. <laughs> With a special thanks to our musical director, Mr. Rafael Cabezas.
and visiting musical advisor, Mr. Rex Kanko. And sound engineer, Jason Agoha. And of course, our presider for the Salubong Mass, Father Jonas Redolia. And a special thanks to our pastor, uh, Father uh, Alden Sisson, <laughs> and uh, Andrew Chang. Father Andrew, Andrew Chang. And we would like everybody to uh, celebrate with us for the fellowship at the Madonna Hall after the Mass. The Madonna thank you Hall again, is everyone. open for us. <laughs> Ernie, did you prepare a lot? Oh, after the Misa, we will go to La Mesa <laughs> for our celebration. Again, let's give them a round of applause, our cast, the crew, and all those who are in the choirs to make this event a successful one. Uh, please stand. <coughs> The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Bow down your heads and pray for God's blessings. But before I prepare, our response would be Amen. May God, who by the resurrection of His only begotten Son, was pleased to confer on you the gift of redemption and of adoption, give you gladness by His blessing. Amen. May He, by His redeeming work, you have received the gift of everlasting freedom, make you heirs to an eternal inheritance. Amen. And may the blessings of Almighty God, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit count down on you and remain with you forever. Amen. Go forth. The Mass has been offered. Alleluia. Alleluia. Thanks be to God. Alleluia. Happy Easter to everybody. Jesus is risen. Alleluia. And you will arise. Rise up, Let the Spirit of God be within you, and you will Rise arise. Up, Jesus, I bind you and bring you to His grave. He is the resurrection and the life.
Oh